<laughs> talking to you, well, I'm not looking where I'm going. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is a gauging lock. Yeah. Again. <clears throat> so a gauging lock, we believe, was where the start and beginning of the canal and it narrowed uh, and allowed people to measure the weight of the boat so they could charge the tolls. Pleasant night, wasn't it? It was, I slept like a log. I've got the fess up, I forgot to take the tiller arm off last night. Anyway, it's still here this morning, so that's a good thing. We uh, just, once we moored up yesterday, we just went in and, and that was it. This was quite just, cold yesterday, but it's, come a, back it's, out. it's milder today, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, a lot milder. Um, At the moment, but it is forecasted it's forecast bunk it down. for mm. about nine o'clock, so heavy rain. Yeah. Uh, so our game plan today is to get past Marple Junction and heading down the Peak Forest Canal. Two things for that, that'll mean that we have actually finished the full length of the Macclesfield, so that'll be another yeah. brass plate I've got to buy, although I'm way behind on buying them. <laughs> uh, and then, we're, we're not going all the way down the Peak Forest today, we're going to find, far, find somewhere down around Bridge 21, I think they said, mm. or just Between beyond. 21, 22. Uh, if there is a more in there. And then save the bridges, the windy up bridges for Carol tomorrow. Yes, I've got two Windy Miller bridges, windy up, and two swing bridges tomorrow. All sort of manual settlements, but they're quiet. Yeah, and that should get Flexing us into where the Whaley Bridge ish. Yeah. We're not quite sure exactly where, but. Uh, and then the idea is to hop the car, hop a train back to the car, go out, fetch the car up, and then we're going to hang around up this neck of the woods for a bit. Still no word on when the Macclesfield Canal's opening for us to get back out. No. So at the moment, we can't really go a, a great deal. It's blocked uh, on Marple Flight, so we can't get down so towards the towards Ashby. Towards the end of May was the yeah. latest. Towards the end of May before Marple opens up, so we've no chance of that this year now. Yeah, not that we were so. particularly planning on going that no, way. But no, but it's, it's a shame, yeah. really. I believe we're due an update this week sometime on what's happening down there. I think it's Bridge 87. Yeah, I think so. Towards Red Bull. Where? <coughs> where, uh, so we can get back out onto the Trenton Mersey and start headed. Well, Hare Castle Tunnel Morning. actually will be one of our next, one of our next uh, major milestones. Yeah, so that'll be looking interesting. forward to that one. I think it's something, well it's a long tunnel, I don't know if it's the second no. longest or something like that. So that would be interesting, although I think you've got a bucket, so yeah. there may be a, a thousand be, people yeah, trying to get through. It's going to be a long queue, because um, everybody's stuck this side of the bridge down there. Um, yeah, the bridge into it's culvert. Is it the culvert? Yes, it's a what culvert around there? a bridge yeah. or something, but bridge, it stops at bridge 87. I yeah. don't think it's actually the bridge that's a problem. It is a culvert of some sort, but they are working on it, so we'll see what transpires. Mm. Anyway, we're now uh, just sauntering our way into Marple. Marple.
Right, we're uh, we're just approaching Marple Junction. Uh, Marple Junction is the end of the Macclesfield Canal. So uh, that means we've ticked another one off the list. It's <laughs> mm -hmm. quite nice in one direction. Yeah. Although we have got to go all the way back down, it, so we will do it in both. Oh yeah. <coughs> oh, two weeks this time of year. Uh, yeah. So we're. Uh, just passing some more boats, which I'll show you now. <laughs> boats? <laughs> Indeed. And there should be a water tap in this little stretch somewhere. Not being warm, is it? No. It's a bit, I would have thought. It's a popular spot, definitely. It looks to be, isn't, isn't it? it? Yeah, it might be one right on the end if we could get in a smaller boat. So, what bridge were that? We, uh, we're coming up to bridge two, I think. Are we? I think so. All right. So there's probably a few hundred yards before we do get to the actual. Uh, or is it? it? Could be one. To the actual junction. So I'll come back no, to you in a minute. It's two. This one. Right, we're uh, just coming up to Bridge One. Uh, interesting old building at the side of the canal here. Which I'll show you now. <laughs> oh shit, let me just do Looking where I'm going. Uh, it's got a bit narrow. Oh. Whoops! <laughs> Talking to you, I'm not looking where I'm going. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is a gauging lock. Yeah. Again. <clears throat> so a gauging lock, we believe, was where the start and beginning of the canal, and it narrowed uh, and allowed people to measure the weight of the boat so they could charge the tolls uh, for using the canal. Obviously, in that way, they pay back the investment in the canal. Uh, as you'll see, as we go under this bridge one, we come to Marple Junction, which is uh, which is the Peak Forest Canal. And there's a sign. It's a sign. I'm quite sure if there's help coming the other way, like we'll find out in a minute or two. It's branch. Yeah. <coughs> Does still work. Oh, just going under bridge one, poking our nose out onto the new canal. Small junction in a small turn. It is. <laughs> have to be out of the way, Chuck. Boats on either side. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Rammed. Straight into Marple Lock Flight, look.
We're out again. Walking. Walking. <laughs> On a bit of an explore from where we pulled up. Yeah. Bridge yeah. 20. Just before Bridge 20, um, it started raining. And so we just took the opportunity really, didn't we, to uh, pull up. To pull in for the day. <clears throat> we did. But now it's stopped raining, so we've come for a wander. It's a little walk. Yeah. It's pull so up. peaceful. And it's absolutely beautiful. Really, really good. Yes, it's probably hear the birds. Absolutely. <laughs> Might not be able to see us, it's pitch black according to that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there we are, we've picked up a bit. You don't need to see us. Not pretty. No. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, it's, uh, this Peak Forest Canals uh, oh, leaves gorgeous. a lot sat on the valley side, so yeah. everything to the right as you're looking at is now is downhill. Mm. Lifts up. It's a uh, cracking spot, really. Nice. Seems like there's lots of decent mooring opportunities along mm. the side. Yeah. I'm glad we're doing it at this time of the year. Um, I think in, in summer might be a little bit more frantic and everywhere's busy in summer yeah, isn't it? it's uh, but it's so the weather's peaceful, nicer though it's gorgeous <clears throat> really nice yeah so uh, this is where we moored uh, just above bridge 19 we uh, jumped in here because the rain started to come down and we decided we wanted to stay dry uh, as you can see bridge 19 is just in the distance over there This is uh, called Tramway Wharf, uh, you've probably seen it uh, as we came past earlier. Uh, I'm quite sure these all look like old working boats. And just up round the corner should be the top of uh, uh, Marple Flight and, uh, and the junction with the Macclesfield. This is the uh, this is the Marple Social Enforcers Club. Uh, but there's a bit of a marina sort of thing going on up here. Uh, a few boats moored as you can see. So this is the uh, the junction, Marple Junction, between the Macclesfield and the uh, Peak Forest Canal. Obviously the ahead is a Marple Flight and the Marple Flight is currently closed uh, and will be so until late May I'm led to believe. Not quite sure what month it'll be when you're watching this, it might be late May, I don't know. Uh, I wouldn't have thought so though. This is Macclesfield where we came from. And in the distance there you should be able to see uh, Marple Flight. Uh, let's see if I can zoom you in a bit. Like that. Well, that's Marble Flight heading off down the hill towards the Ashby Canal. Not quite sure which lock number it is that's uh, that's closed. I'll put it down below. Marble Social Club seems like the place to be. Clearly, when I was talking to you earlier, I got my bridges mixed up because this is Bridge 19 and it's just after Marble, so. I'm guessing we're moored next to bridge 20. Apologies for that. Here we go. Made it back from the walk. Enjoyed it. Rain's held off so I haven't got wet. Oh no. <laughs> Good morning everybody. Good morning. We're uh, going to try and make a push for Whaley Bridge today. Three bridges, I believe. Four. Four. Two manual, two, um, well, all four manual, two lift and two swing. Um, all right. So Carol will be in action. That's it. Had a nice night here, didn't we? Managed Ooh. a nice walk yesterday afternoon when the rain stopped. Yeah, yeah. Very quiet. Rained in night, but, uh, yeah. yeah, no. It's mild, really mild. Yes, it's lovely. <laughs> Summer's coming <laughs> for a bit. Hopefully. Until next week. Uh, I've even I've been allowed my ears to come out on show for a bit. Oh. And I can't find the woolly hat, which I'm assuming is inside. It's loomed somewhere. Oh, I bet it's in my pocket. Oh, okay. 
So yeah, so we're uh, trundling down the uh, Peak Forest. So really, this will take us to the end of the Peak Forest as far as we mm. can get. All being well. Yeah. Uh, we'll service the boat down there and then try and find somewhere to tuck up. It is very busy down there. It's, it's always very popular, isn't it? Yeah, the we, unfortunately, we saw about half a dozen boats coming past in the same direction <laughs> yesterday, so <laughs> quite sure I will go yeah. on for mooring spots, but we'll do as best. Then we need to go and repatriate the car from uh, from Whitley Green, Whiteley Green. Whiteley Green. And we were next, uh, I think I mentioned it actually uh, to you yesterday afternoon, but Bridge 19 was actually Bridge 20. Yes, yes. So I'd had a, a brain, brain, a brain faff as, as usual. We, we just pulled up a, a bridge earlier than what we intended because of the rain, but uh, it's not too far. Anyway. If we see anything of interest, we'll keep you posted. Slightly hindered because my action cam tripod has, uh, oh. oh, not the tripod, the arm thing has come unglued. So oh. I need to be oh, careful yeah. I don't lose it into the drink. It was <coughs> all part of the sport, I suppose. Oh. Right, we're just coming up to the uh, the first swing bridge, which we think is a windy miller. It's a lift which, bridge. Some relic, we're going to put you a Windy Miller. So, for those of you in the States and that, understand what Windy Miller is. It's an old it's children's cartoon from yeah. donkey's years ago when we were kids. So, Are we'll. You me? <laughs> I, were, I was a child, Carol was 25 or something like that. Oh dear. It's a lift bridge, by the way, not a swing bridge, I think. That's already a lift bridge, yes. <laughs> We'll, uh, we'll leave the uh, we'll leave the video running, and you'll be able to hear her puffing and panting as she's winding the handle. <laughs> yeah, uh, they are with the possible hard work. they are <laughs> expletive here and there potentially. Oh, depends where they're started. Absolutely beautiful views this morning. Really, yes. really nice. Top of the world. Trundling through the high peak. Right, Carol's just made it to the bridge in the distance there. I don't know if you can see it. Uh, I'll try and zoom you in a bit on in post if I can. Oh, she's winding. She's windy millowing. Miller millowing. It's a puff now, it's slowed down. <laughs> but, uh, of the boat out so that we can get through the bridge. So Nearly fell over on the slippery stones. I think they're actually hydraulic these bridges. So Carol winds the handle which is actually a hydraulic pump and I think if you look at the top there you can see hydraulic ram that's opening it up. Uh, they're not all like that, the cable. Got my muscles working. All right, Tiger. Woo! <laughs> Can't get your blood up. <laughs> He's back. How, how was that for you? <laughs> He's warmed me up. 
Thought the muscle was working. And I was a practice. Uh, a fair few wines to get it up, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, you just, you just go in forever and it doesn't seem to move. It's hydraulic, that Quicker. One. So you're winding a pump. Yeah. Pushing that ram at yeah. the top up. Uh, it's quicker going down than going up, it's just... <sighs> well done, Chuck. So that's bridge one of four, is it? Yes. <coughs> good, good. 